All right, here's the front of the machine. It's all pretty much boxed in. I just figured to show you what it looks like. I still have to finish a few things, but um, yeah, that's it all boxed in. So when you get it, the first thing you want to take off is the face of it. And I'll have it marked that it's the front. So you take the face of it off. You'll just unscrew everything. This is what you'll get. And then down here, I've got a 15 pound weight uh, strapped in and that's super solid, but you want to remove that weight. Uh, you can see those little chunks of wood. You want to remove that one, that one, and that one. And those are just all keeping the base of it locked into place. Because uh, it's not bolted to the pallet or anything. It's pretty much sitting inside the box. Uh, but there's no room for movement at all. You can see I've got it all blocked in up here. Um, so it's all pretty secure. But when you get it, you got to take the face off of it. Take these cross beams off, get rid of that weight and those three blocks. Um, and then I would suggest just taking all the walls off. And all you gotta do to take the walls off is pretty much remove every runner. And if there's screws underneath the runner, remove those too. And you just remove all the runners and all the ones that are across. And you pretty much just take all the walls off. Uh, you take the roof off of it, which is kind of a thicker piece of plywood. And the best way to move this thing off the pallet is to just completely disassemble the crate, which I made really easy to do. So cool, man. And any questions you have while removing it, anything like that, just let me know. Uh, also, when you get it, you're going to want to grab by right there. You want to grab low because it is top heavy. So you want to grab these front uh, beams, but you want to grab them right by the, right by the, the base there. Anyway, cool, man. Uh, you'll be seeing it soon.